Welcome to the Real Mackay, the Scotland Today video blog. Now, if you watch the 5.30 show this evening, you'll see a, a temporary change because uh, Rachel is uh, standing in for Debbie, who's on a break. Rachel, you've uh, you've deserted the news, basically, is that right? I have, yes. Um, just for two weeks, though. And, uh, right, I'll, I will ask you about that in a second. Um, so how are you looking forward to it? Um, I'm a bit apprehensive, but I'm sure Stephen will be gentle. Yeah, uh, we've got a look there from Stephen. We'll, we'll, ask, we'll, we'll ask Stephen in a moment. No, I'll ask him now. Stephen, are you going to be gentle? Of course I will. Yeah, no, it's lovely to have Rachel with us. And uh, we're going to have great fun over the next couple of weeks. And we'll treat her very nicely. New girl on the block. Toilets are over there, by the way. <laughs> And uh, the reason I said, what I said I was going to ask you about was, uh, what's, what's your first subject? I hope, something easy to get into. Yes, yeah, something very easy. Sex, could you really be addicted to it? Not something you want to Google lightly <laughs> on a company computer, <laughs> I must admit. So it's, it's going to take a different approach, obviously. Um, Not yeah. just the subject matter, but your whole uh, appearance in the programme. Yes, I've had to go off and uh, buy some clothes that aren't black, black, black. Mm. Um, try and blend in with Stephen and his pastels <laughs> <laughs> and his pinks um, yes it's when um, Howard boss was talking to me about it he said you know you've got to be aware that it's a very different approach from um, the way you deliver the news very straight and obviously you're you're sticking to the script the whole time and with this program the, um, Stephen and Debbie can afford to be a bit more relaxed about it and ad lib a bit more but obviously you've still got a very strict time constraint so it'll be something quite new and exciting. And of course your, your background, I mean you did uh, the ITV News Channel, you've done ITN and all the yes. rest of it. So You'll be, particularly with the news channel, you'll have had to do some of that anyway, so it shouldn't be that unusual. Oh, yes, for but I was used to being on my own. <laughs> I've got to allow Stephen some time to talk. Um, no, you the don't have to. <laughs> no, the, the news channel was a great experience, and I, I don't know why I'm feeling so nervous because it's, it's 24 minutes of the show, and you know, news channel. Sometimes you'd be on there and you'd finish your three hour stint in a morning of three hours of no loo breaks, no nothing, and you'd get a. Um, a sort of a, a one-line message coming down to the studio. Um, so and so, I'm not going to use any names, has decided they've got a photo shoot. Can you do their shift as well? And it was normally one of the bigger guys uh. at uh, ITN. Mark Austin. <laughs> Andrea Catherwood was that? No. No, no, no names, no names. <laughs> no, and normally, you know, they they were up to their eyes with doing other bulletins, and they'd always try and book things in when they knew they were meant to be down on the news channel. So sometimes you could be doing six hours of rolling news. How do you sustain that? It's exhausting, and you were downstairs in the basement of ITN on your own, no food, no drink, no nothing, and you'd run out to the loos in a. They'd sort of play an extra long. Um, bumper, you know, mm. sting or anything like that, try and throw in another advert and in the middle of that you could run out and they'd bring you down cups of tea in a Mars bar. <laughs> really? That's what yeah. you sustained yourself with? Yeah. But so chocolate when, smears and all the rest of it when you get back on camera? It was fine when it was um, interesting breaking news and, you know, the adrenaline was keeping you going through all those hours, but when it was um, reading the same thing time and time yeah. again, then it got quite dull. So this is a lovely chance to do some short punchy interviews and fun subjects as well. Are you looking forward to it? I am, yes. Let's we'll see how it goes. Good luck to you for that. No Thank doubt you. you'll, you'll cope well. You. Uh, and you'll see that on the 5.30 show. And of course, Scotland Today is on at 6 o'clock. See you then. Uh, we are